I was talking to someone this morning and asking them how they were getting along during this lockdown period. And they said something like, well, you know, you get up in the morning, you breakfast, you try to fill the morning, then you've lunch, you try to do something useful in the afternoon, and then it's tea time, and then maybe watch TV in the evenings, and then you're off to bed. And I kind of knew how they felt. Maybe you do too. It's difficult to know what to do with the time. Sometimes, other days I'm very busy, but let me tell you the most useful, enjoyable, helpful, valuable thing I've done this week. It's doing the congregational Bible readings. Monday I was reading Titus chapter 3. I noticed that it talked three times about doing good. It helped me to use Monday well to do good. A request came along for a bunk bed and since we're moving house soon we happen to have a a bunk bed that we're not using anymore so it was a wonderful opportunity just to give that away to a family in need. Tuesday, read Numbers 21 and saw again how all the Bible's about Jesus and how simple faith is. And then, strange book of Ezekiel on Wednesday, but I realised what a wonderful gift God had given us, even more than Old Testament believers, in that God's Holy Spirit now dwells in our hearts. And last week I had the great joy of, when I was reading in the Old Testament book of Malachi chapter 3, there were some verses I read and I just, when I was reading them, I just thought, you know, that makes me think of some friends of mine. I think those verses would really help them at the moment, so I shared them. And they said, yes, it was really helpful and they appreciated that. So I'd just like to say that sometimes we say we're too busy to do important things, but I don't think we can say that at the moment. And I'd like to say that if you want to do these congregational Bible readings with me and with our congregation, you'll find them week by week on the church website and on our Facebook page. And I will guarantee you from my experience of reading the Bible all my life, but also from reading, doing these readings over the past few weeks, that not only will the time doing the readings be well spent, but you will discover that it will help you to spend the rest of your day in a really profitable and useful way. So take it from me once again. This is really worthwhile. Man does not live by bread alone, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of God. <laughs>